division, and this is an incredible matchup on paper. The lightweight championship of the world for UAL is going to be contested, and we've got two incredible arm wrestlers to do this thing. The Flash, Corey Miller, about to defend his title against the incredible rising star that is Jamie, the natural Sheldon. Let's get over to Bruce Buffer, and he's going to introduce our athletes. Ladies and gentlemen, this next match is five rounds for the UAL Lightweight Championship of the World. Introducing first, he has a top roll hook arm fighting style, 16 inch forearms, 16 inch biceps, standing six feet tall, weighing in at 154 pounds. From Riverside, California, the four-time state champion, the UAL3 lightweight tournament champion, and the number two lightweight contender, Jamie the Natural Sheldon! Jamie the Natural Sheldon is on a tear. This young man is supremely confident, and I can tell you, he has come ripped and ready. His body conditioning is phenomenal. He's fresh off an incredible victory at UAL 5, and he wants this. He believes this, and this could be a night for the upset. And his opponent, he has a flash top roll hook arm fighting style. 14-inch forearms, 16-inch biceps, standing 5 feet 10 inches tall, weighing in at 165 pounds. From Cheyenne, Wyoming, the 15-time national champion and the 2010 triple crown winner, the number one lightweight contender in the world, Corey the Flash Miller! Ladies and gentlemen, a dominant North American champion comes in the form of the Flash. Now you see it, now you beat the Flash's speed, and he is revved up. We used to see him go multiple classes, not today, ladies and gents. Singular focus. The tail of the tape reads 29 years of age for the Flash. 5'10 and 163 pounds. He says he's way too fast. Sheldon, 32 and 6 feet, slightly bigger. This man is explosive. He can top roll, he can hook. Versatility is a weapon for Sheldon. Michael Todd, what have we got in store? Can the natural put the brakes on the speed? It, that's that's the question, obviously, but I mean, Corey Miller is also very, very strong, so when he puts the brakes on him, he's still got to contend with that power. Your man in the strikes for this one will be Bill Collins, master referee of the UAL. 